Ah, Rafa, 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 Medical, 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 doping, eh? Doping, doping. What about doping? What about doping? Diyalo, ay ko ang bahasa na. Ito ko ni ito ni Weta ay ko ang spirit smart. Kwa Ito ito ko ay Nagayin ito ko ang Latkos Nagayin ito ko ang Latkos Ay ko ang bahasa na. Ito ko ang bahasa na. 21 km. Ah, so, okay, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, next year. Mm. Mm. Next year. Sasa juu atonge na mende changu ada mende Paris. Na tumbi tu walio fanya training na labda kuchini walio na fanya training. Eh na fanya training kama mti. Pande wasa pashi pishi. Tuna train wake na chofu mudai. Ai kuamba ya sana kuanza wewe ni mzuri sana. The course ni poa sana. Kambia tu ni wapi pengine umekimbia labda na umemaliza position zipi? At on on 8th no 7th this month I ran at Keberiko 10k and I was the second position. Then I I ran Paul Boyd Memorial Race that is peace 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 race. I was number 6 in Eldoret. I saw me kwaje kutoka position 6 kutoka position 2 na kwa 12 21 km uko kwa namba 1. Umekuwa vipi? I usually like 21 km than 10k. That's my best race. Yeah. So, how many 21 kilometer races have you run before? I've run many races in France and USA and Mexico. Yeah. And my best time used to be 71. Yeah. And uh, right now, okay, Stanchard Marathon is done. We still have a, a few races to go locally. Are you looking at the local races or are you thinking of uh, international races maybe? I'm hoping for international races now. Uh, Probably where? Do you have anything in mind? Might be Europe or America. Yeah. So it is the first race you've won in 21k. I've been warning in outside, but in Kenya this is my first race. To win in Kenya. Yeah. And I enjoy my shinda gun. In my shinda house still go America. Why do you think it has been very hard for you? It has taken you so long to win a race in Kenya while you have been winning races out there. Ah, you know Kenya is very competitive. Usually, because other people have no chances to go outside, so they use their talents here in our country. And so it's very hard to win. Bring happy and standing and give a big round of applause for Anders Kepene. Ladies and gentlemen, Anders Kepene is the new 42 kilometer standard challenge of the Marathon champion. There you have it, a new champion. Once again, the Narupi Marathon proves to be the most challenging one. He has not been uh, Stanjad actually, he has helped us a lot. So Stanjad, he has helped uh, those who are not able to see. And Stanjad also, it has, begun, it has helped us, as, especially as Kenyan, even the bank itself, it has helped so many Kenyans. So, so we are proud of Stanjad because this is the first race started in Kenya and it is, it's like a relay started here in Guinea and then he goes to other countries. So we are bound. What do you want to invest in? Uh, you have something in mind? Yeah, I have something in mind because uh, I have a blood in Helloran, uh, near town, so I need to build uh, rental houses. Yeah, that's my plan because I have that. Yeah. So yeah. Ten, ten, uh, your time was 10, 10. This is my BB. Yeah, debut. I am debut. Yeah, this is my BB. Yeah. So basically, and what is your fiance's name? What's her actual name? Uh, who? Your fiance's name. Uh, yeah, Pamela. Pamela. Yeah, Pamela Cheruta. Cheruta. Yeah, Cheruta Cheruyat. Cheruyat. Yeah. She's also an athlete. No, 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 no. I, 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 she's a, a student. Student. Yeah, at Baratan University. Yeah, yeah. Number one, zero, zero, one, and you can do better than that. Margaret Solet is coming into the finish, approaching the last few meters of the finish line of the 2011 Stella Challenge, the women's category. And there she comes in, the 
you have a new champion of the women's category the 2011 Sarah Challenge Army Marathon which was won last year by Helen Kipro na mkiri marathon ni mekimbia nyingi lakini sicha win ni mekimbia namba moja mali pengine mali pengine namba mbili tatu namba tano lakini kwa Kenya sicha wai kimbia marathon Kenya hili kwa yangu ni marathon ya kwanza Kenya Mwana umetek long sana kapla kimbia marathon Kenya Eee ni metek time kwa sababu nilikuwa ni mepata managers wengine na nikakua sasa nilikuwa ni mesai na wawo so siku kuwa na nafasi ya kupewa ni kimbia But this time ni mekua tu ni kitri na some people lakini likuwa bahari siya sign contract ya yote. Na watu ingi wanasema kukimbia Kenya ni ngumu kwa sababu ya attitude. But we umekimbia Kenya mara ya kwanza ni kakua ndo mara yako ya kwanza kushinda marathon. Ni pipi? Na ndivyo ni mekurai kwa sababu ukiwin marathon Kenya ama resi ya yote. Una possibility ya kukimbia time zure sana ukiwenda inje. Kwa kweli Kenya ni ngumu sana kukimbia kwa sababu ya weather na most of the athletes pia wako strong na kila mtu anakimbia fast so ukiwin unashukuru Mungu sana kiwango ambao hata siwezi kuelezea Na sasa tuambie vile vile ulipangilia mbio ulianza aje katika katikati vipi ulimiki movie yako wapi na vile uliona unaweza yenyewe uweza ilikuwa kwenye kiwanja Nilipoanza kabisa nilikuwa najisikia niko very weak niko light na nilianza nyuma kama namba tano hivi ama sita lakini nili keep on ku, ku, kufikia wao nilipo wafunga wasichana wa aina ama watano waliokuwa mbele nikafikiria siwezi kufunga na nikae na wao kwa sababu ni laughter nimetumia some energy kufunga hawa nikaona nipite tu na nishikilia wanauma ambao wako kwa barabara so niliendelea kufuata miguu ya wanauma ambaye nilishikana miguu na kama amekuwa slow nina wachana ninajaribu tena kuenda kushika mwingine tena ninaposhika nina nasikia pace kama ni ile nitaweza nimalize nikiona ananishinda kwa nguvu zaidi nikajaribu kupita tu pace yangu yeah This is my I think my eighth year running standard chartered marathon. I've only missed one day it started the year it started. So I've been doing it and uh, this year I think I've done quite well. I didn't do a full marathon because I didn't have time to train but I ran a half marathon and I think I have run a sub 2 or less than a sub 2. Yeah, I mean, uh, for a 57-year-old uh, running a sub-2, that, uh, that is not bad. Comparing that, I'm running with elite runners who are less, I think, uh, they are 23 years old, and I am more than double their age. And uh, what keeps you going? What keeps you, you know, every day you wake up, you think, uh, there's a race there, and I want to run there. Uh, I'm, I think my greatest joy is to make a difference in people's uh, lives. That is what drives me, at least, if I can make a difference in people's lives. I run for charity. And again, I ran for physical fitness. All right, receiving a check is the third place, 350,000, Emily Chepkoril Perpetua. And in second place, to receive a check prize is Wilfrida Kwamboka, receiving a 650,000 shillings. Kazi mmefanya leo, eh? Two hours, Drew. And number one, 1.5 million shillings going to Margaret Toroy Teach, the winner of the women's category in the 42 kilometer in the Senate Chart and Nairobi Marathon 2011. Hip hip! Hip hip! Asanteni, thank you very much. That's the top three finishers. All right, for third place, Bona Maniki. Our tattoo on a patio elfu mia tattoo nam sini, begin him a coffee. A round of applause for third place finisher in the 42 kilometer, Simon Kiprop Tomoi. Number two, Franklin Chepkoni and a pata elfu mia sita nam sini. Nam shini and a pewa shilingi millioni moja nukta tano, 1.5 million. All right, a coffee. Atam Kok knows that it's a mecca dugu. But a big round of applause for Anders Kevin A. Fantastic display. Unfortunately, he didn't manage to get close to the record set last year by David Barmasai of 2 hours 10 and 31. We're expecting at least some 210 time, but then again, it proves to you it's going to be a tough, tough one, and it has proven that this year round. So now I'll ask everybody to be upstanding once again, DJ.
Nauliza nyote msimame tafadhali as we play our national anthem. Thank you very much. Epi applause for the top three finishers 42 kilometer category and just to remind you it's made up of some of the best athletes we have they were running in the elite race and the winner Arnes Kerbenei is actually following the footsteps of David Barmasai who won it last year and I spoke to him earlier and he said his next big one is the Dubai Marathon which will be coming up in January